In this video, I'd like to walk you through the process of chaining and sharing a .stp file from both sender and receiver perspectives via Outlook. Before you get started, please make sure you have installed the Outlook extensions from i2Chain's Settings menu under Download section. To start the process, I attach the .stp file on a new message on my Outlook. Outlook has a native i2Chain app plugin that allows you to classify the file. In this example, I'd like to share a confidential file. The attached file francis underscore asm .stp converts to francis underscore asm i2c. Now, I have assured the file is secured, traceable, and revocable to be shared. You can send the file to the targeted recipients now, and view the transactions on the web app or desktop app under the Shared by Me tab. Now, on the recipient side, a new email with a web link will pop up in their inbox. As first-time I2C file recipients, they click on the web link and select their email address in the new window. Then they can create an account or view the file as a guest. I'll go with the second option in this example. The last step is to verify their email address to move forward. It is a heavy file taking a few more seconds to load. Please have patience. Here you go, they can view the file now. Besides, i2Chain provides the user with a toolbar at the bottom to investigate the 3D model in more detail.